should work, right? But then you got to tie it back to a coordinate system. So, like, if we had just a map of nothing, we could do grid lines of one-inch squares, sure. In actuality, the Mercator map, as a equal distance projection, actually does preserve directions like that because you can dead reckon. That is the map that you can get on, take a ruler, draw a direction, right. and then dead reckon that direction. People try to do that on the azimuth equidistant projection. That's absolutely wrong. That's the wrong. As soon as you put a ruler on that map, you're using it wrong. The direction is a revolving cylinder around the central cylindrical axes right that's what direction preserving is and that's why the directions match reality or in your case you can say that's how the directions match the globe so if you're taking that projection and you're using it as a with a ruler then the directions are no longer preserved they are corrupted right so that that's not how that works I what i was saying though. oh grid lines yeah <laughs> so long the, the mercator map was a longitude latitude it's a spherical graticule but it's spread out in equidistant one inch squares so that you can use it to navigate with dead reckoning that way so like we, we we could make that we could say the mercator map works but it's just tied to the stars everything on our world is tied to the stars man like